How's everyone doing? Hope everyone's having a great night or day, depending on what time it is for you. Happy Friday. If it's still Thursday for you, then happy Thursday. Another random stream. I know, again. Um, I'm, I, I just don't have a streaming schedule anymore due to working. And uh, again, I apologize for that, but... I'll try to stream whenever I can, however, whenever I feel like I can. <laughs> but, um, I'm able to, or I want, I wanted to stream tonight, and I was able to stream tonight. I am able to stream tonight, um, because today is my off day from work, so, yeah. 
Um, I can stay up late. <laughs> but, um, and I say today because it's technically past midnight for me, so it's technically the next, uh, the next day. Um, so, yeah, we are playing Pokemon again. Um, it's, uh, been a, been quite a bit since we last played Pokemon. Um, I'm, if I remember correctly, I'm pretty sure the last thing we were doing in Pokemon was, uh, shiny hunting. Um, but this time, with the new release of part one of the, the DLC, the Teal Mask, we are going to be playing that tonight. And I'm pretty excited. Um, I didn't, like, pre-order or pre-purchase, whatever, um, this DLC or the DLC bundle. Um, I just bought it, like, two days ago, I think. Either two days ago or yesterday. <laughs> I think it was two days ago. Um, well, I guess it's technically reordering because I think the Teal Mask came out yesterday. And I got it two days ago, so I bought it the day before it came out. <laughs> I guess it's still technically considered pre ordering or pre purchasing or whatever. Um, anyways. Either way, we have the uh, DLC bundle, so I will be able to play the uh, Indigo Disc DLC when that comes out um, later this year, during like, over the winter. But um, yeah, we are now able to play the the first part, first part of the DLC. So I did boot up the game right after um, I bought the DLC bundle so um, what happens is when you first boot up as you can see at the top there it's, it tells me it's telling me to go to the entrance hall and that's because um, when I did boot up the game after I bought the DLC bundle um, professor Pro oh my god I can't talk professor shock will call you on your Rotom phone and he'll tell you about a field trip on um, you know going to another place and stuff like that and uh, you are one of the lucky students to um, you know chosen to attend that field trip um, and he also said now a lot of students are chosen to go because it's a long trip um, it's a be a pretty lengthy trip to, uh, over to wherever first DLC is taking place. Um, I forgot the name of the the island or whatever, but um, yeah, he just gives you details of the trip, um, to tells you that you are one of the chosen students, and uh, tells you to come to the uh, entrance hall of the school for more information on the field trip. So we are here in the well, the front entrance of the academy and as you can see we have um, some new clothes, some new uniform or a, un or a bunch of new uniforms but I'm wearing the new summer uniform. I believe this is a new summer uniform when you buy the DLC bundle. Um, I didn't really like the other, I don't know. I just I didn't like the uh, the the other uh, seasoned uniforms, so I, I like this one. But uh, yeah, we put on every new thing except for the hat. Um, I wanted to keep the black fedora hat that we've been wearing for quite a while. Um, but yeah, we got the new actual uniform. We got um, new socks, shoes gloves and the new backpack on that you get from the DLC bundle and uh, let's get inside shall we oh also we are gonna go into this DLC with a new team um, not the team that we use we're not gonna be using the the team that we use to um, you know throughout the main story of our uh, of, you know the main story of this game but I decided to use a new team. 
Um, these are basically all the shiny Pokemon that um, we've acquired um, in the game. Well, some of them are from um, Pokemon Go. So the Chandelier, uh, Delphox, and Haxorus are from Pokemon Go. While Iron Bundle, River Room, and Roll Time here, these three shinies were actually acquired in the game. Well, like, I actually shiny hunted for these three in the game. And yeah, and I caught the other three in Pokemon Go. And as I said before, these are all shinies. You can see here, we got Shiny Chandler, I nicknamed Wyatt. Iron Bundle, I nicknamed Telebird. River Vroom, I nicknamed just, I guess, Revy. <laughs> um, Rotom, Shiny Rotom, I nicknamed Raiju. Um, because of Baz. <laughs> uh, Raiju is a ghost, um, it's a type of ghost in, um, in Phasmophobia or I guess basically any other ghost hunting game nowadays, which deals, you know, Raiju is a ghost that, you know, messes with electronics and I think it fits Rotom because Rotom is an electric and ghost type. So I think Raiju is a fitting name for Rotom, even though I have Rotom in its uh, fan form because I wanted to have some um, diversity or variety of types in our team. So we got a shiny Del Fox I named Hita and shiny Haxorus I named X Jaw Morgan. It's a reference to uh, a character from One Piece named X Han Morgan. Um, I wanted to name I wanted to name uh, Exorus X uh, X Head Morgan, but it wouldn't fit. <laughs> so I try to make it fit um, fit the you know the limited the twelve letter limited name. So I just shortened it. I guess named him X John Morgan. <laughs> um, but yeah. This is our team. This is our team that we're gonna be taking in into our Teal Mask DLC playthrough. I don't know if I'll be using the same team when Indi uh, the Indigo Disc DLC comes out. I probably will, I don't know. Or maybe I'll use a different team, I don't know. I guess we'll see. Um, but yeah. This is our team. Hopefully it goes well. <laughs> Hopefully it's um, diverse enough in typings. And um, yeah, I guess let's, uh, let's head inside finally. Let's go talk to Professor Jacques. Whoever he is. Where is he? Are we supposed to talk to him? Or are we supposed to talk to... The... Oh! We're supposed to talk to this lady. Mr. Jacques said the students for the school trip would be around here. Am I the only one? Wait. This... I don't think this lady was part of the main story. I don't think I remember seeing this lady in the main story. I mean, apparently we never met her because, well, she has question marks for her name, so we don't know what her name is. Hmm? Are you... Oh, you must be. You're one of the students chosen for the school trip, aren't you? And your name was... Bliss, ma'am. I guess we'll be polite. Bliss, huh? Well, aren't you a polite one? You're positively dazzling. Oh. And you even have a Terra Orb. I guess Paldea is rich enough to wait, rich enough in resources for that sort of thing to become or wait to be a man. Wow. Well, I don't know why I'm having 
like problem reading and speaking right now. Oh my god, maybe it's because I haven't been streaming for a while or at least on a consistent basis. Jesus, I guess Padea is rich enough in resources for that sort of thing to be a common sight at school. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Unless that's not the case, are you perhaps an especially, especially exceptional student? Oh, but here I, here I go on and on, and I haven't even introduced myself. Call me, Miss Miss Briar. The Briar? I'm assuming it's Briar. So sorry I'm late. Oh, hello to you too, Bliss. What a lucky scamp you are getting to take part in a school trip so soon after transferring here. Wow, he just interrupted her introduction. Damn. Sure I am happy for you. I wish I could go too. Ahem. <laughs> Huh? Oh, I'm sorry, Miss Briar. I got a bit carried away. Well, as Mr. Jacques so kindly stated for me, my name is Briar. I'm a teacher over at Blueberry Academy. I like her eyes, though I feel like she's evil. I don't know. She has like cat eyes, sort of. But she, I don't know. She, she looks like she could be evil. That's a school in the Unova region, you know. Miss Briar helps set the uh, curriculum there. Unova region? Are we about to go back to the Unova region? Is that is that is that a uh, is that a clue? Wait, Unova is Unova is um black and white region, right? For Gen 5? Gen 5's region? Which is black and white? I mean, it's no coincidence that they mention Unova and black and white are the next or Gen 5 is the next um, the Gen 5 games are the next uh, generation or the next um, games to be remade as Gen 4 Diamond and Pearl I mean as a failure as that remake was um, was you know the last remake so I'm pretty sure they're hinting at um, you know black and white's remake game maybe I don't know uh, this year is Blueberry Academy's turn to run our joint school trip and supervise the students. That's why I came here to collect you. We'll be heading to Kitakami, a land known for its picturesque fields and rice paddies. The place has a rustic feel, but there's also something rather mysterious about it. You see, the same energy present in Paldea's uh, terrestrial Terrestrial? Terrestrial? Terrestrial phenomenon has been detected there. I'm hoping to do some digging into the matter myself, in between my supervising duties. Though I'd also appreciate the chance to take a good look around the great crater of Paldea. Ah uh, yes, well, there's not much I can do about that without permission from the Pokemon League director Clavel. Or Pokemon League and Director Clavel, sorry. Oh, I know. I've already put in all the proper applications. I trust that I'll get a favorable response soon. Uh, well, hmm. Oh, sorry, Bliss. Forgot all about you for a moment there. Anyway, the school trip. Think of it as a chance to continue your treasure hunt on a grander scale. Continue your... Oh, well, bad. Um, to search beyond Paldea's borders. I'll even provide you with a special update to your Pokedex app. If you get... Uh, if you get out your phone. Oh, you're gonna update... Um, or add more 
Pokemon to our Pokedex. Yeah, the Kitakami Pokedex has been added to your Pokedex app. And there we go, all done. Now you can go wild registering all the Pokemon you find around Kitakami too. Oh, and don't worry about a permission slip for the trip. I already cleared things with your mom. You just go and have fun. Wow. Took care of everything, didn't he? <clears throat> <laughs> your Mr. Jacques is quite charming, isn't he? Delightfully direct when he wants to be. Now then, Bliss. It's quite a trip to the land of Kitakami. I hope you don't mind flying or long bus rides. Let me know as soon as you're ready to set out, won't you? Okay, so set out for the land of Kitakami. All right, so mentioning um, the Kitakami Pokedex for uh, Chandelier here in particular, um, prior to the DLC releasing, you weren't able to transfer or catch because um, Litwick, the Litwick um, line um, aren't able, you aren't able to obtain the Litwick line in the base game of Scarlet and Violet because they're not part of the main games, the main games uh, Pokedex. Um, the reason um, why I was able to have Chandelure here in my party right now is because Chandelure, or I should say the Litwick line, um, is part of the Kitakami Pokedex. So, yeah, that's awesome. Because I remember when um, Scarlet and Violet first came out, or when I, when I saw the Pokedex, I guess, um, for the, you know, the main Pokedex of Scarlet and Violet, Litwick and its evolution line was not included. And I was pretty bummed out because I wanted to have a shiny Chandelure um, as my... A flame body like egg hatching Pokemon up in my party um, but that quickly got replaced by uh, shiny Volcarona but I'm actually really happy now that Litwick and its evolution line are in this game through the uh, Kirikami Pokedex that's awesome all right um, I guess we'll just talk to we'll just talk to her again. I'm gonna save her here real quick before we talk to her again. All right, let's do this. Are you ready to set out for Kitakami Bliss? Yes, let's do this. Let's go! Great. We'll set out together as a group once the other students arrive. I hear you were. You, uh, you were all chosen for this trip by lottery, so this may be the first time you meet. I know my role is to chaperone you kids around, but I finally, uh, I fully intend to have some fun on my own while I'm at it. Just so you're aware. By the way, do you know the Violet Book? Uh, oh, it. Yes, I think we've. Heard it or seen it? Pretty sure it was part of the main story. I don't, re I don't remember a lot of what happened in the main story. Um, aside from like the ending main, like ending boss fight with uh, Professor Turo. But other than that, I don't quite remember what happened in the main story because it's been a while. As you should, it was the most influential book of the century on the subject of the paranormal. The author of the Violet Book, Heath, was in fact an, an, uh, an ancestor of mine. They even have his original manuscript. Well, aren't you fancy? <laughs> Look here, these are the pages that were blacked out and made illegible in the published version of the book. 
Oh. Okay. Interesting. A disc Pokemon? While separated from the research team in the crater's depths, I found a strange entity. Whether it was a Pokemon or even alive at all, I know not. It bore a shell with layers of overlapping hexagons, and gleamed brighter still than uh, brighter still than gemstone. Viewed as a whole, it resembled a mysterious, brilliant disc. Cool. I have tentatively named this creature Terrapagos. I, sus uh, I suspect that its very body is made up of the key materials, or key material, that causes Pokemon to shine brightly and crystallize. Pokemon depicted on these pages is called Terrapagos. It's a mysterious Pokemon that Heath allegedly encountered when he delved even further into the depths of Area Zero. So we're talking about Terrapagos, which is... I'm sure the main like legendary of the Indigo Disc DLC. But we're playing the Teal Mask DLC. I'm pretty sure they'll be connected somehow. Um but it's interesting. Uh encounter when he delved delved even further into the depths of Area Zero. Not that the general public believed him. Also, where she pulled that book out from? He didn't have a bag. Just put it out, pull it out of her ass, you know? Like every character does, <laughs> I guess. It's my dream to find Terrapagos and prove that Heath's records were all true. Though I haven't been able to secure permission to enter Area Zero, unfortunately. And that's fine. Uh, it'll all be fine. All I need to do now is focus on the work that's in front of me. I wonder... I'm pretty sure the Indigo Disc DLC will make some changes into the Area Zero... Um... Well, area. I wonder, I wonder if it'll like, add some new places that we can go to and stuff. That'll be pretty cool. It's Briar, we're ready to go. Looks like the gang's all here. So it's only four of us? From our school? Huh, that's so little. Alright everyone, to the land of Kitakami. Let's go! Oh, a little plane. Oh, that's a Dragonite. That's cute. They're gonna sped up ahead. Oh shit! The hidden treasure of Area Zero. That's the whole like the name of both the DLC bundle. Part one, the teal mask. Hey, oh yeah, I'm so excited for this. Oh, <laughs> there's already um. Some raid dens over there. We're finally here. My butt is killing me after all those hours sitting. First the plane, then that bus. I know that feeling. So, <laughs> um, yeah, like when I would, um, the only time I would fly is when I would, uh, you know, visit my family over in China. And the flight, as you can possibly already know, is a long flight. And when you sit, when I sit for a long period of time, my like tailbone area like hurts. Like I can't like once it starts hurting, I like I can't sit still. Like I have to adjust in my seat like so many times to get comfortable. But it's just it like it. It hurts. <laughs> so I know I know what they what they're going through. <laughs> well you all survived a long trip. 
We haven't lost anyone along the way. I mean, there's only four of us. Yeah. I mean, wait, where are the students from her school? Is she only just watching over us? You did mention that there are students from her school that are coming here, right? All here. And welcome to the land of Kitakami. It's like, it looks like we're out in the countryside. This is the stage for all the new experiences and learning opportunities you will have out in nature. Oh boy. Hey, Yanma. There's whoopers. Oh shit, those, those are uh, Jetonian whoopers. Oh, that's cool. It's actually my first time here too. Why the rice fields really are just dazzling. I feel like the, I feel like dazzling is her favorite word. She used it twice now. Up ahead is Mossui Mossui Town Mossui Town. That will be our base of operations for the duration of the trip. Miss Briar, I don't feel so good. Uh oh. All that travel must have given you a dose of motion sickness, hmm? Why don't we pause here for a moment and take, take in the sight of these fields? Now, Bliss, I have a little request for you. Could you run ahead to the community center in Mosui and let the caretaker know we're here? We get to explore. I would also, it would also be great if you could explain that one of our students is feeling unwell. I'm on it. I knew I'd be able to count on you. On your way then, I'll look after your poor travel buddy here. Poor travel buddy. Aw, shit. We head to Mossui Town. All right, look at this. Ooh, we got some items around us right now. Can we go to them? Like, how far back can we go until, you know, Briar, this Briar is going to tell us, no, that's not the right way. Hey, Pucciana. Level 56? What the fuck? A level 56 Pucciana? Oh my god. So I guess Puchianas are are new. Are new to the game. So let me uh switch over to uh, Um I still have some Pokemon here. Get rid of Hmm. Okay, we'll just use this box for now. Yeah, we'll just use our egg boxes for now. To catch some Pokemon! Catch new Pokemon. New Fainties? Cool. All right. Ooh, look at our look at our shiny chandelier in the open. That looks so cool. <laughs> All right, we're just gonna wait. Oh, not that. yeah, there we go. Let's just use a quick ball on it. Hey, there's a Yama. Is that a crit catch? What was a crit catch? Hell yeah. Pokemon. Yeah. Can claim her. Oh, 
got rewards? Hold on. Uh, how do we check our Pokedex again? Got it. Nope, not that. Nope. Ah, fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not that. Is it? Whoops. Is it only through the map here? Switching between maps. Press L or R while the map app is open to switch between different maps. Flying taxis will take you to any location with a feather mark. Even if your destination is in another region. Cool. Yeah. So this is the map of Kitakami. Ooh. There's a question mark outbreak there. Interesting. Another one? Oh, this is cool. There's a Puchiana outbreak. Nice. Oh, this is interesting. So even Kitakami has like some center area. Interesting. Alright. Oh, whoops. Close to... Uh, which one? Pudex. Wait a second. Wait, so some of the Pokemon from the base game is part of the Kitakami Pokedex too? It's interesting. Let's see what reward we got. EP up. Nice. 100 volumes. Bottle cap. Uh, ooh, we get a Razor Fang at 110. So we have 104. We can catch 6 more new Pokemon and we'll get that. Huh? Oh shit! <laughs> Wait, I didn't mean to throw at the cutie fly, I meant to throw it at the Yanma. Oh well. What was that next to me? I saw something next to me. Yay, another new Pokemon. Hey, what was next to me? Oh, hey, Spinarak! I'm just gonna be using Quick Balls. Catch these guys, catch our new Pokemon. Until we're at the point of, uh, in the DLC that we actually have to weaken them. <clears throat> Don't worry, uh. <laughs> um, sick student. I'll, I'll take care of you in a second. <laughs> Let me just catch some Pokemon first. Is that a cave? Is that 
cave in the upper upper left corner or is that a shadow? That's a shadow. Just to, make, just to make sure that they're going to the right. Okay, yeah. Sweet. That is a shadow, right? Or is that a cave? No, it's a cave! Oh, shit! Paralyze heal. What's in here? Nasty plot. Oh, yeah. Again, we'll. <laughs> we'll get to the sick student and the community center real soon. Hey, there's a regular whooper. Watch that. Oh yeah. Oh, they even count, like, other, um, other forms as new Pokemon, I guess. Other regional forms. B5 there, is an item over here. So we can't, uh, get on Maridon at the moment. Potions. Over here. Bulldoze? Cool. Oh, hey. Have I caught you yet? Um. Sip waddle? Yeah. Catch you. So catch, noise. Okay. Other new Pokemon around. All these like Pokemon are pretty tight. I can barely like run into them. Oh boy! Oh hey. Powder. Hey, another TM over here. What's this? Grassy terrain. Okay. Antidote. Pokeball. Pretty sure we can't go back there. Try. Big open field. There's a person over there. This item here. Potion. Soda pop. Oh. Oh, that's another cave. Hey, you, dude. Oh, you dudes are new. That. Uh. Hey, come here. Go. I thought you dudes were already in the game. Guess not. Okay. 
can claim another, or we can claim the Razor Fang. But we'll do that later. Okay. Trick. Sweet. Guess we can now craft it because brought an actual like description of the uh, of the move. Right, we'll talk to that trainer after we explore this last bit of area here. <gasps> A Mariana! Ooh, okay. Uh, let me grab this item here first. Good ball, cool. Alright, let's go! Mightyena. We don't have to evolve our Poochyena. We got the full uh, Poochyena line. Oops, I did not. Damn it. Looks like uh, it's everything we can catch here. That we caught everything. All right, let's go talk to the trainer. Pretty sure it's gonna trigger a battle. Hello there. Go go go, Geo dude! My favorite little round buddies. Easy to pick up and carry with me. Challenged by Kazuaki? Kazuaki? Kazuaki, the festival boy. Yo! Alright, so he has two Pokemon. Um, we are going to switch out Telebird. Missed. Let's do Let's do flip turn. I've seen what that does. That looks like Aqua Jet. Oh. So it's basically a water type uh That's basically- so it's basically a water type U-turn and Volt Switch. Yeah, so it's- um, yeah, it's similar to the Volt Switch and U-turn. Assuming. I think. Well, yeah, you know. Um, let's go with... Go with extra. It's easy to hit their weakness. Uh, hit their weaknesses too. 
Thank you for the 2200 Poke Dollars. Yeah. You sad boy. <laughs> Alright. I think we. Oh, whoopsie. I think we've explored everywhere we can. Except for the bit that's more up ahead. Towards the. Uh, Towards the actual village or town. Let's actually go forward this time instead of back. Let's see if we can encounter more new Pokemon. I'm gonna save here real quick. Hmm. I think he has a headache or something. Okay, move forward. Ooh, core fish. Core fish is also new, okay. this hill thing? We can. Sweet. Items up here we can grab. Nether. Berry. The potion. Antidote. We go even higher. And we can. This. Four. Cool. So I know I'm not going to be using it, but. Great to have, I guess. Some EXP candy. This is done for. Ooh, an area dose. Psychic Terra type area dose, four star. Oh, shit. <laughs> Little guy ran into me. We already caught you, so uh, just leave ya. We go into the field. Yeah. Getting our feet wet. Ruining people's crops. Outbreak. Oh, so we're oh we're close to the Puchin outbreak. Okay. Eek! Oh, I can sense the game stuttering a bit. Yeah, I think the game is stuttering quite a bit now. Battle you. Eek! You're one of those people from Paldea, aren't you? What if I am? You got a problem with that? The fuck? Mayu the festival girl. Yeah, there's a bit of stuttering going on. Or, yeah. This, like, the animation is like slowing down. There's a lot happening. <laughs> it's just too much going on in the game right now. Uh, let's use Shadow Ball. Bye bye. Jeez. 
Chingling. Uh, it's not right, you. Hey, Homer. Welcome. How you doing? Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Mm, oh my God! Stop fucking lying! Is that? I know. All good. No worries. I know I haven't been streaming as consistent as I used to be, but it's just, it's, it's because of work, you know? You didn't my you. Oh, she's crying. So this is the Paldean style of battle, huh? Yeah, give me your money. Work. Our one weakness. Yep. He bought? What? He's... Here? Oh no. He hasn't said anything. I don't know if he's here. He is here. Hi. I guess he got found out or something by by Homer. What do we got here? Ooh, five star dust noir. God damn it. Alone. Try and explore. Is that a... Is that a Chimeco? It's a... Better head to the community center. No, but I want that Chimeco! <laughs> My god. They actually put me like right outside. No, I don't want to go in there yet. You can't make me. I want to explore, damn it. Hey, there's another core fish. Here. Uh oh. Oh, my game froze. What the hell? I think, yeah, I think there's like too much going on in the game right now. Game's kind of. kind of lagging. Side here. Whoa, boy. if we can go on the other side. Go. Get up there. Here. How many Pokemon around? Turn here. Hey, whoopers. Mm -hmm. I mean, I guess at the same time, we are getting, we're like making our way closer to the town. Eh, let me up there. God. Game did not crash on me. Okay. 
I think we're good now. I think... Right, let's actually head into the community center now. Ooh. Oh, it's those two uh, characters from the trailer. Sis, look, there! There's one now! Oh, shit. <laughs> Guess you can ran towards me, what the heck? So, you're one of those students who came from the Padea region, huh? Wow, way cool! Hush, Kieran. I'm Carmen. Carmen? Or is it Carmine? Carmine? <laughs> is it Carmen? Or is it Carmine? I don't... I don't know. Sorry, but I can't just let you... let an outsider like you wander into Mossy Town. Why is she smiling like that? If you insist on coming in, you'll have to battle me first. But come on, sis. I just want to battle, making this big fuss over nothing. I told you to hush, Kiki. <laughs> My God, she looks crazy. <laughs> just ignore my little brother. Oh man. All right, let's do this. Get in position. We bought the fight. About to throw down. Look at us. Look at our our character's face. So determined. I'm going to have some real good fun with you. Oh, we're about to kick your ass for sure. Managed by Pokemon trainer Carmen. Now Pucciano, man. I thought you were gonna use like upper. Pokemon. <laughs> I didn't read that, sorry. Alright, let's kick this thing, Zarius. Ultra guys. Ooh, it's the one from trailer. <laughs> it's the regional variant of Pulte guys. Well, not really a regional variant, but you know. Ooh, so cool! Can't wait to catch one. I think it's a ghost and grass type? Yeah. Bye bye. <sighs> you know about <laughs> about match type matchups, huh? Yes. So I do. Is that a Vulpix on the roof? Uh, speaking of Vulpix... Uh, let's see... Let's go... Heavy Bird... Water balls. Bye bye. Yeah, we win. Suck it. 
you. Who are you? I'm the one that's gonna rampage through this town. <laughs> Bowser's, you went and beat my sis? Can't believe it. There's no way you should have been able to beat me. Oh my god, she's crazy. <laughs> I don't know why, but she reminds me of Nessa, the, um, the water gym leader from Sword and Shield. She also has like that type of temper tantrum <laughs> thing going on, you know? I don't know. Leebot is here. He's <laughs> he's in you. Oh my. <laughs> Fine, I guess you pass. Barely. What do you mean barely? You did nothing. You did no damage to me. This girl. Seems I've got no choice. I'll let you into town, but only if you become one of my grunts and do every little thing I. Oh, you little shit. You were about to order me around. Here comes trouble. Come on, Kiki. We're out of here. But but I. Wait up, sis. Who this guy? Well, hello there, stranger. You must be one of the students from the Paldean Academy, right? I help run the community center here in Mossy Town, and a fair few other uh, other things besides. Um, I'll be looking after your group during your visit. Hope those two kids weren't giving you any grief just now, were they? Eh. I only know what to do with those. Uh, with the two of them, especially with that Carmen. Always been a handful, that one. Apologize if she gave you a hard time. We kicked her ass. <laughs> What's that? A member of your group fell ill down by the bus stop? I better get over there and give them a hand so they can make it into town. I'll take care of everything. You go ahead and get yourself settled in, settled in at the community center. We'll catch up with you soon. Oh boy. Active old man. We head into the community center. Alright, so we are in Mossy Town. Um Of course we're not gonna go straight in, I wanna explore. Just hope it doesn't like tell me not go too far. You know? Yeah, I'm not gonna cross that bridge because I'm pretty sure it'll just tell me to come here. You know, back. Ooh. Ooh, what's this? Amnesia? Okay, okay. Nothing special, but okay. Ooh, oh hey, some more items. Oh, yeah, I'm over here. Rip. Spite. Oh. This item here? Yep. Hitakami Road. Yeah, I don't want to like venture off too far and have the game tell me, you know, to go into the community center. Just gonna try and uh, explore within the actual town. Yeah. We're just so lovey-dovey. What? <laughs> Pretty much the most lovey-dovey couple ever, don't you think? You bet. There's probably not a pair on the planet as perfect to get as perfect together as you and me. Right? The fuck is going on? Hey you! 
We're wondering if there are any Pokemon that are lovey-dovey like the two of us. If you manage to find any, bring them here. I'm sure you'll find one. When Lechonk fly... Ahahaha! <laughs> ah, this douchebag. <laughs> A lovey-dovey Pokemon? I don't, I don't know. I don't know if they're... They're... Was it Bulby and Illumise are one, maybe? Um, what else? Wait, no, 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 no. Game. No, I didn't want to go in there. Fuck. This way, everyone. Yes, I owe you one for fetching the caretaker. A little travel buddy is feeling much better now, too. Alright everyone, this is the community center. This is where you'll be staying while you're here in Kirikami. The plan was to have you and students from Blueberry Academy stay here together. But it turns out this space is going to be all for you. Our visitors from Uva Academy. Why? Alright, those two kids were uh, originally from this town, weren't they? Two kids. Then you come, don't be shy. Wait. Wait, are Carmen and Kieran... Are they from Blueberry Academy? Were they? Or are they? I don't know. Pretty sure they are. I'm assuming they are. Come on, everyone, pack right in. Oh, no need to worry about your shoes or anything. You can leave them on in here. They're extra dirty. Just try to rinse off the worst of the mud using the washing station by the door. That's convenient. Oh, hey, look. There's a little like chingling assortment, whatever. There. It's cute. Nice and clean inside, don't you think? It's all newly built, so it's as good as anything you'd find in one of your big fancy cities. This here is the lounge. You can watch TV, chat, or relax however you like. And well, let's see. Over there is the cafeteria, and toilets will be down that way. If we want to get some sleep, please use the rooms down the hall there. We've got enough space that each of you can have a private room to yourself. Oh. Nice. So I think that about covers everything. But if you run into any trouble at all, don't you hesitate to uh, talk to our fine staff at the desk. Thank you for the tour, sir. Alright, kids. Do you have anything to say to the staff who will be uh, taking such good care of for us? Uh, of us? Sorry. Uh, we're glad to be here. Thanks for having us. Thanks for having us. Thank you for having us. Why is why is that guy doing a chicken dance? <laughs> what the hell? What the hell is that guy doing? Ugh. What a bunch of well-mannered students! I can already tell you're going to have- uh, you're going to be wonderful visitors. So you just think of this place as your own home, away from home, and relax. You must be all tired uh, after such a long day. I know it's a bit early still, but why don't we have dinner, then call it a night? I've got plenty of food ready for you all, so I hope you've brought your appetites. All right, food. Thanks for dinner. You're free to spend the rest of the evening as you like in the community center. Remember that tomorrow the program will be officially kicking off. Don't stay up too late or you might oversleep. 
we we get to explore. So that means we can't go out, can we? Talk to one of the students. Food here seems really healthy, but it was still very uh, really tasty too. Let's say a conference room probably won't be using this. See what's on the TV. There's a video showing off some of uh, some of Kirikami scenery playing on this giant screen. Okay, okay, okay. You, what do you gotta say? I wonder what's scheduled for tomorrow. I'm so excited that I don't think I can sleep. Did you enjoy the taste of our local Kirikami fair? Welcome, dear Paldean student. We provide a special service to visitors here at the Kir uh, Kirikami Community Center. If you've opened your bag and whatnot while you've uh, been here, you might have noticed that the theme of the upper and lower borders of your screen to menus now changes depending on your location. Do you want to change the settings for your uh, for the upper and lower borders of your on your menus? Uh, yeah, let's see. I hope you enjoy sightseeing around Kirikami with your current settings. Wait, menus. Oh, that's so cool! Oh, that's that's really cool. Oh, that. oh not that either. That that's that's really cool. That um, the borders change. That's really neat. Depending on your location too. Assuming these are bathrooms. The boys' restroom, girls' restroom. What's this? What's this room? Oh, this restroom can be used by anyone. Oh, so so we got male and female bathrooms and gender neutral. That's inclusive. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's talk to you, sick boy. Checked out my room and there was a bug Pokemon in there. Oh. To be you then. Very cold tonight? No. Wait. Are we able to go outside? We can leave. Probably best not to wander alone at night and then know your place. God damn it. Oh well. Uh, where else can we go? We can't really go anywhere else. I don't really call this exploring if we're just gonna be exploring like the the area. <laughs> oh well. All right, let's just call it. So they are from Blueberry Academy. Morning everyone, did you sleep well? Starting today, you'll be joined by our two students from Blueberry Academy. Why only two of them? Why are there four of us but two of them? Go on kids, time to introduce yourselves. Hi, I'm Carmen. It's a pleasure to meet all of you outsiders, I mean visitors from Haldea. <laughs> This girl's gonna be a bitch, isn't she? Uh, I'm Kieran. Carmen and Kieran actually grew up here, so ask them for help if you need anything. No, thank you. And you two had better be of real help, you hear me? Aye aye. All right. Now uh, that that's settled, why don't I tell you all a bit about what we have planned for you? This school trip of yours will be an exercise in orienteering. First, we'll have you split into pairs. Then each pair will be tasked with finding three signboards located around the land of Kitakami. 
On each signboard, you'll find snippets of an old folk tale passed down here in Kitakami. Read them and uh, read them all and learn a bit about our home. Prove you've completed the task. We ask that each pair take a snapshot together in front of these signboards with their phone or camera. Oh, are we really about to do like? Do we really have to do it? Do that part? I mean, or is the game just gonna automatically do? It? Uh, take a photo together in front of each of the three signboards to complete your mission. It's a self-guided tour of Kitakami. Learn all about its rich history. Much more fun than sitting around and listening to me ramble on and on, eh? Wonderful! What an innovative idea for a group activity. Oh, and I've got a gift for each of you as well. Boy, what is it? Ooh, a Rotos! Oh, right. <laughs> selfie stick. <laughs> A selfie stick. I don't know why we need a selfie stick though. Because our Rotom phone already floats as it is. So why can't it just float to help take a picture? You know? I don't understand. That's just useless. A stick to rest a Rotom phone on. It allows you to take selfies from a little bit further away than you could on your own. What do you mean? Like I said, the Rotom phone already floats. I'm pretty sure it can float higher than our height. So I don't understand why we need a freaking selfie stick. So dumb. <laughs> Okay, the roto stick. Press the X button while in selfie mode to use your roto stick. The roto stick adds some extra distance between you and the camera, making it easier to take photos with your friends and Pokemon. This is stupid. <laughs> Hold on a second. <clears throat> Where these things are all the rage in the big cities, use them when you take those photos. I even teach you a rad pose I came up with all on my own. Oh boy, here we go. You learned the Eureka emote from the caretaker. Ah, uh, yes. Real rad. Remember that one of the goals of this trip is to deepen the ties between our two schools. It seems like having someone who knows the area well would be a big help. That being said, let's try to maximize the number of inter-school pairs, okay? Time to mingle. Oh my god, right. if we get paired with Carmen, I'm gonna be... This is, this is not gonna go well. Talk to the kids from the other school. Oh my god. Alright, Karen, what's up? Oh man. Oh man, what? You're bliss or whatever, right? Let me guess, you want to pair up with one of us, poor lonely blueberry students. I want to say no, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna just say yes any either way. Gosh, it's so sweet of you to go out of your way like that. What will we ever do without you? Oh yeah, so my little brother here has been all googly-eyed over you since yesterday. He wouldn't stop talking about you, even at home. I seriously couldn't get him to shut up. Sis, what are you telling her for, uh, telling her that for, dummy? Hey, who are you calling- who, Wait, watch who you call dummy if you know what's good for you. Oh man, oh my gosh, she's bully. <laughs> I 
I know the feeling too, because I too have an older sister. Hate it. <laughs> Look at him being all shy. See, my brother's no good at talking to people. He's probably never worked up uh, work up the nerve to ask you himself, but he'd really like to battle with you. Sure, we'll battle, why not? Uh, what do you know? Turns out you're... You're sort of nice. This will make my brother real happy. Shut up, Kiki. This says she'll battle you. What? Wowzers, really? You don't mind? Doesn't mind a bit. Get to your positions, you two. Everybody else, clear out. Make some space. I got this. Oh man, I feel bad for... <laughs> I'm gonna feel bad for beating him. I can't believe this. I get to battle you. This is awesome. Um, I feel real bad for <laughs> killing his Pokemon. <sighs> All right, let's. I'm gonna buzz those wings. What? Oh my god, the Yanma actually went first? Well then. Oh, <laughs> guess I got a lot of weaknesses. He didn't expect his Yama to go first. Maybe that's a scripted thing. Wowzers. He really likes saying that, doesn't he? Good show. I see done, kids. Nothing like a friendly battle to get to know someone. Wowzers. You sure are strong, Bliss. Really aren't half bad. Kiki's nearly as strong as I am, you know. I don't know about that. It's orienteering thing. We're supposed to group in as uh, group us a uh, group up in pairs, right? I should go ahead and pair up with Kiki then. What? No, sis, don't. Don't what? It's not like we. Uh, it's not like we can pair up. Or. Or were you hoping to partner up with some other rando outsider instead of Bliss? Well, no, but... Man... Don't worry, he's just being shy. I'll go find some chump to pair up with too. Watch out for my little bro, you. I don't like her. Looks like you've all paired up. Let's go ahead and mark where you'll be going with uh, those rotophones and rotom phones of yours. Now then, off we go to do some exploring. Oh, and if you find yourselves in need of any potions or pokeballs or the like, head o head on over that away. Stop by Peachy's. They'd be happy to set you. Uh, wait, set you to rights. Um. 
So it looks like we should probably start with the signboard at Loyalty Plaza. It's all past the apple orchard. Orchard. Orchard, yeah. Orchard, um, on the west side of the village. It's close by, and I figure it might, um, make sense to, you know, visit the mall in order? I'll probably just get in the way if I stick too close, so I'll just follow you from a safe distance. Oh. Huh? And... Alright, take a selfie at the signboard, but we aren't going to do that just yet. Oh my god, look at the Pokemon Center lady here. She looks like a thug. Hey there, this is the Pokemon Center. Are your Pokemon tired and needing a rest? Yes. Okay, I'll take them here for a sec. At least she's nice. I thought she was gonna have an attitude or something. I know, and the rest of your team should be all better now. Come back whenever you need. Okay, cool. He's a nice Pokemon, uh, Poke Center lady. That's good. Alright. Oh, hey, you get a Union Circle here too? Nice. Okay, okay, okay. That's cool. Alright, let's check out the store here. Lovely of you to stop by. Take your time and have a look around. Oh, <gasps> we can buy clothes! Hold on, let me look at the items first. Uh, Alright, nothing too special. All stuff that we already have. Oh, we got ingredients here too? Damn, this store has everything, doesn't it? Oh my god. And it has picnic stuff? Cool. Alright, let's see what clothing you have. It sucks. It sucks, but well, it's just the trim that's colored, not the whole sock. The yeah, pants. That's kind of dumb. All right, next. Gloves, uh... knitted gloves. Interesting. Okay, so there's only gloves and socks here. They do look pretty cool, though. Hmm. I don't know if I'm really interested in buying any Alright. I think we're good. Just wanted to check out the stuffs. Um... There's any other we're missing on those items, but I feel like we can't leave the town without the game telling us to go back, you know? Alright. So he went this way. I'm gonna keep exploring. We'll catch up to Kieran. I 
in a bit. Well, I hope I'm pronouncing the its name right. Is it Kieran or is it Kyron? Apple Hills. Octum. Ball, no. Up here, is it both? Bell sprout, fine. The fomantis is a bell sprout. What's up here? Potion. Is it gonna tell us to like? If I go too far, is it gonna tell me to go back? Maybe. Ekans? Do we have an Ekans? I don't remember the main game had Ekans. <gasps> Ooh. Oh. Oh. The game doesn't. We don't have an Ekans! This guy, I guess. Oh, it's a quick catch, wasn't it? Nice. Oh god. Oh no! We're falling! We're falling! No! Oh. Okay, I wasn't sure that we could have uh, Miraidon out. Didn't really try to call out Miraidon. Oh, we got a tart apple. Oh hey, Centret. Meet you. Do you have a Centret? I don't think Centret was in me. Catch you. Fomantis. Just gotta make sure here. Okay, yeah, we do have a Fomantis. We do have a Pichu. Spell again. Let's see how far we can go up here. Oh my god, that Pedev was T posing. I saw that. Oh, cave. Mine. Ooh. Oh my god, so many Geodudes. Oh god, this Geodude's chasing me. Now leave me alone! God, so many Jew dudes here. Oh, you're wearing a mask. Are you part of a cult? 
Be part of a cult? Ogre Clan? Right, Kiri of the Kirikami Ogre Clan. The lightning I wield will shake you to your core. Ooh, this is interesting. Raikiri of the Kirikami Ogre Clan. Wait, what level is this Raichu? 75? Wow. Yeah, I didn't expect that Raichu to be that high of a level. I thought it was gonna be like 50 something like the others. No, Wyatt! Jesus, why does your Thunderbolt do so much? Well, it's because of the critical hit. Luxray. Nothing. All right, it's because of light screen. Light screen wore off now, so I still did nothing. Hey, you flinched though. It's okay. Oh god! Um... Ow. Man, these guys are strong. Is a f level pass is a s fucking steel type, I think. Ooh. Fuck, I don't have any. I don't have any fighting type attacks. Ooh, this is 
Again, another oh, shit. Another, yeah, Beak of Vault. That's a bug type and a bug and electric type, so both heater here. Fire plant. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, I'm paralyzed too? Well then. Oh god, thunder hit. Wow. Defeated a trainer from the Kirikami Ogre Clan. Yes, I have. Does that mean something? I gave the battle everything I had in me. I have no regrets. Oh god, I'm surrounded by Geodudes. Um, the moment I exit out this conversation, I'm gonna trigger a battle. Um, you guys leave me alone. <laughs> They're just surrounding me. God damn it. There's one on me. God, leave me alone. Think this ain't gonna move. Are you just gonna sit there? Why... Why is this trainer in a cave? Oh my god! <laughs> why is this trainer in a cave full of Geodudes anyway? This is so annoying. Now I'm gonna trigger a battle with the one that's on me. Oh my god, it's gonna be a never-ending battle, isn't it? Am I... This is stupid! This is so stupid. Right, is there another one on me? Oh my fucking god! <laughs> this is so dumb! I'm, I'm in a... I'm in a loop of Jindu battles. <laughs> I can't get out of it! <laughs> I can't get out of this cave! Oh my god, finally! I'm out of here. Let's fuck this cave. 
Oh my god, that was so stupid. Oh. Oh. I need to go to the Pokemon Center, but I want to explore more. Apple. Alright, I need to go to the Pokemon Center real quick. Where is it? That trainer, man, that uh, trainer from the Ogre Clan really did a number on our party. Okay, that's a Hisuian arc. Uh, Rowlet. <laughs> and um, this is. I f I saw a comment, and um, I mean I also noticed this um, in the trailer, but this. Is uh, this girl is related to um, what's his face from Legends Arceus, the leader of the 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 Diamond Clan, whatever. I've got his name, but I'm pretty sure that guy's an ancestor of hers, cause they look very similar. And not to mention she has a Hisuian Growlithe. Anyways, um, whoa, where'd you come from? I didn't even notice you there. Anyway, you are... Wait, no, don't say a thing. I want to guess first. You're one of the students who came here from the Padea region on a school trip. Did you know? <laughs> it's a small town, you know. New trends, t uh, or news tends to spread pretty quickly. Name's Parent, by the way. I'm a traveler with a bit of a bit of a thing for photography. It's also very pretty. <laughs> this here's my bud Rowlith. Doesn't the little th the little horn on its head make it the cutest? Awesome, yes. Yeah, this might sound a bit weird, but would it be alright if I took your photo? Sure. Just like that, huh? Are you always this open with total strangers? Kind of worried about you, kiddo. Anyway, let me snap that photo. Got a unique vibe, you know. I like it. <laughs> it's a bit different than what I'm used to. I'm gonna make. Uh, I'm gonna be making this town my home base for a little while. Why don't you focus on wrapping up whatever you've got going on for now? Come see me after, I don't know, registering 150 Pokemon in the Kitakami Pokedex or something. 
You, what? <laughs> Just gave us a random... Like... Objective to do before talking to her? She has a little ponytail. That's... Cute. <laughs> Alright. Anyways... Can we get that item from down here? Can't. Carbo's not. Alright. Um... I don't know where Kieran went, but... I'm gonna save here real quick. I don't know... I think this really matters, but I want to connect to the internet real quick, too. beans apple hills okay what other Pokemon are here is that a tandem mouse that is a tandem mouse you Ooh, is this a couple here? Yeah, the guy's wearing no shoes. Oh my god. Wait. Okay. <laughs> In the world. Oh my god, I just realized like their clothes look like like was it like those like fancy name brand stuff? Oh, the positive energy is positively flowing. I just love to buy up all this kata uh, Kirikami air. It's my dearest own air. Even while out in the boonies, your ideas are still purely metropolitan. I do appreciate your willingness to speak the truth, Billy. I don't like these two. So, my dearest Onair, however, shall we waste our time and our money today? The fuck? How oh, indeed. Versace? Yeah, that too. Like Coach, um, Gucci, and all that. Lavish shit. Uh, Billy, look, a commoner. They're staring at us. Eh? A commoner? Why oh, yes, your eyes do not deceive you that there is almost certainly a co wait that that there is almost certainly a commoner. As I live and breathe, a commoner living, a living breathing commoner. All right, stop calling me that, fucking asshole. <laughs> Jesus. Whatever should we uh? Whatever do we do, Billy? Is it bad manners to ask to shake their hand? Is it acceptable to ask for an autograph? Look yourself, my dear Onair. No need to rush. Look, this commoner isn't going anywhere. I wish I was going somewhere. Oh, fuck. <laughs> like, I wish I went to look for Kieran instead of talk to these two. My apologies. It's not every day that I come face to face with a uh, face to face with a commoner, you know, or you see. Sorry. Naturally, you're the president of Padea Padea Realty. Huh? Excuse me. Yes, you commoner. I swear to God, if she calls me commoner one more time. <laughs> Would you be so kind to as to indulge me in a duel with your Pokemon? If you can defeat me, I will grant you riches beyond your wildest imagination. I call bullshit. But yes, I will gladly kick your ass. There it is, Onir's favorite pastime. Throwing the common folk a bone, you... Ooh. <laughs> 
Please come see me once you're ready, dear commoner. Alright, I am ready to kick her ass, but first... I'm gonna save. <laughs> I'm ready to kick your ass. Will you duel me for riches beyond your wildest imagination? Yes. I, Omnir, the president of Paldea Realty, will crush you, commoner. Oh, I can't wait to kick her ass, I swear to god. Weep. The fuck kind of laugh? Weep, 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 weep. <laughs> How do you even laugh like that? Go get him, Onair! Why is she standing so far away? Glitterati? Oh my god. Onair of the Glitterati. Oh my god, she's also using a luxury ball. But she's so fancy. Game is, uh... Lagging a little. <sighs> Level 65. Oh, she only has one Pokemon. She only has one. A Persian. And of course it would be a Persian. Yeah, get burn, you fuck. Yeah. Fuck off. Yeah. So, this is the power of the common folk. 17,000. Wow. A lot of money from her. Really, something a commoner a cut above the rest. <laughs> Not even defeat can eclipse your beauty on air. Now, listen to me, commoner. The most important thing about money is how you use it. Spend that reward on something meaningful, an investment in yourself. That way, you'll continue to sparkle even when your money is gone. Come now, dear Billy. I think I'd quite like to go see that waterfall in Paldea. Only just arriving in Kitakami, yet, we, yet now we are returning home. You really are an ex exemplary glitterati. Glitterati. I regret talking to these two. Oh, I just, that was, uh, quite the conversation and quite the battle. Ooh, look at this field. Hard apple. Crates, a shed, and open. Luciana just sleeping on the side of the road. Oh right, this is an apple orchard. Or sorry, I don't know why. I don't know why I keep saying orchard. E. We we can craft that. I think. I feel like there should be applins here. You know? Would it make sense to... Wait, that's an applin right there! <laughs> Speak of the devil. Yeah, we should catch this applin. Because applin has a new evolution. I don't know how you 
how to evolve into that new evolution, but... Oh, we'll see. I wonder if we can talk to the people in this orchard. Is it orchard? Is it orchard or orchard? I, now I, I'm like... <laughs> No, no, I don't even know which one's the right pronunciation. I guess this this would be an easy way to catch Applins, because I think finding Applins in the in the main game was pretty difficult. I think. Oh, another trainer. Let's fight you. Got to greet a person properly if you want to have a pleasant battle. Now let's go. That's who Tatsuro? Bell sprout. I'm slow. Critical hit. Oh, that was it. Nothing in like the warm glow of good sportsmanship. You say so. Alright. Talk to these folk. Oh, we can't talk to these folk. We're too busy picking... ...picking apples. Man, my parents will have a field day, pun intended. <laughs> um, like, picking these apples off of the trees. Like, my parents would, uh, used to go to, um, like, actual apple orchards, or orchards, however you pronounce it, um, and pick, like, bags and bags of apples and bring them home. Like, we would have so many apples at home. <laughs> like, we'd... Yeah. I know we're supposed to go past the orchard. orchard. Um, I'm trying to get all the items here. Making sure I have all the items. Ooh, the there are Pokemon here. What's oh, an Applin? Type are you? Bug type? Interesting.
We got what we got. Sunny day. That's crap. Orchard, orchard, whatever. The trainer. What was it? What was that trainer? I saw a trainer. There you are. Get everything? Hope I did. Apples, I love them. You have an apple? Love them raw. That's what she said. I love them cooked. I even love them in battle. <laughs> That's by Minami, the festival. Oh, she doesn't have an apple. <laughs> How about that? Dear Applin. Oh, boo hoo. Bug bite. Cool, I guess. Quick ball. Three quick balls. Hell yeah. I think we're good now, maybe. Hopefully. Oh, there's another TM. Sweet apple. We got here. Best. Mm 
a sweet apple. We're just seeing the same Pokemon now from the beginning. Any new Pokemon around? The road that leads down. This way. Up this way, you'll find Loyalty Plaza, but we should have a battle before you head in. Ah, yeah, the delinquent. <laughs> Now you're ready to head in. If you say so, lady. What does the sign say? Wistful Fields, Loyalty Plaza. I think we're going to Loyalty Plaza, right? Is that what Kieran said? You choose. For a candy. Ooh. Some phone apps. What? Save here. What you gotta say? Hey, I'm a traveling app developer. See, we got a Rotom phone. Here, let me add a snazzy new feature for you. Phone has been upgraded. That's your phone case. <gasps> Ooh! The upper and lower frames of compatible apps can be set to match the design of the phone case you have on your Rotom phone. Give it a whirl with different Ro uh, Rotom phone cases to try a new look. Ooh, that's cool. Mm-hmm, technology really is incredible. So I, have a, I think I have a Foycoco case. So... Oh, that's so cool. That's so cute. <laughs> That's really cool. I like that. Alright, so now we're in Loyalty Plaza. I don't 
think there are wild Pokemon in here? Is this a sign? Is this a sign we need to take a picture in front of? That's cute. Uh, yeah, is this the sign we need to take a picture in front of? That's the first signboard. S sorry, did I startle you? I did mention that I'd hang back and follow you here. But what do you mean? You ran, like, ahead of me. So how were you behind me this time? We're supposed to read the signboard, right? Oh, I already know the whole story. So, g go ahead. You should check it out. Alright, let's see. Long, long ago, there was a fearsome ogre in the land of Kitakami. The ogre made its home in the mountain behind the village, threatening all who ventured there. One day, the ogre came down from the mountain in a terrible rage, causing great fear in the village. By some stroke of luck, Okidogi, Monkidori, and Pheasantipity all happened to be there as well. The three Pokemon laid down their lives to fend off the ogre and send it back to the mountain. In admiration, the people of the village bestowed upon this brave trio the title, The Loyal Three. The remains were given a proper burial, and statues of the three were erected above the site. Wait, they died? The Little Three Monument is right over there. Don't you think the ogre in that folktale sounds kinda cool? Yeah. Right? I knew you'd get it, Bliss. It was up against three whole opponents at once, battling it, bat battling it out all by itself. Bowsers, oh, that's so cool. Oh, but I guess most people would just think an ogre like that is scary, huh? I don't think there's any reason to be afraid. When I was little, I went up into the mountains so many times at night on my own, and I never, never met, never once met that ogre. The only scary thing that happened was the grown-ups giving me a real earful about it. Um, so yeah, we're supposed to take a photo in front of the signboard, right? I don't have a smartphone. Did you? <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Look at this, like, shy, half-assed peace sign. <laughs> okay, it's a good thing that they automatically do it. Because, yeah. I don't want to make a picture. That's awesome, though. Oh, man. Dang. I should have uh, taken a screenshot. No. Fuck. I should have taken a screenshot there. Wait, when did I save? Maybe I can still go back. I don't know how long ago I saved. on. Might regret this. <laughs> I'm gonna restart my game. I don't know how long ago I saved, but we'll see. I feel like I saved right before I went into the plaza, right? Hopefully.
Yeah, okay, cool. Okay. Okay. Right, right, right. I got the app. Save. So cool. <clears throat> Interact with the sign again. Skip all the stuff that we already read up to the point where we were about to take a picture. It's a. Uh, I wonder if we'll do different poses at every sign. Turned out great. You're even good at taking photos. Wanna try? Oh no, I didn't mean. Maybe next time. You know, I didn't want to have a have to come to do this. Come do this whole school trip thing, but, well. Might actually be kind of fun. I get to be out in nature around my hometown and talk to you, Bliss. Hey, if you want, maybe we can set up a picnic. Would you like a sandwich? Oh, shit. <laughs> you talk about sandwich. Freaking right, I'm like one. Love some sandwiches. that thing I'm kind of kaiju or something kaiju <laughs> a kaiju this maraid on it's called maraid on and you ride on it huh you ride on it huh never seen another pokemon like this It seriously comes out whenever it hears the word sandwich? It loves them sandwiches. Never thought I'd actually get to meet such an awesome Pokemon. No wonder you're so strong, Bliss. You're... You're special. So the next... Alright. Uh, we should go to the next signboard. It's on the grounds of Kitakami Hall. Um, Kiryokami Hall is... Well, first double back to town from here, then there is this bridge you cross from there. Oh, is it on the other side? I did see a bridge. Uh, and from there, you need to climb up the mountainside. I'll hang back for, for now and meet you there later. 
Oh, okay, bye. Make a selfie at the next signboard. We'll do that in a bit. There's an item here. What do we got? Ooh, toxic. Ooh, very toxic. Oh, there's a monument. Okay. That was like separate monuments. Never mind. Are there any items around the monument? Ooh. All right, let's see what the monument. Ooh, what's the sign say? Loyal three monument. Long ago, these three courageous Pokemon protected Mossweed Town from destruction. They defeated the ogre that had come to attack the village at the cost of their own lives. The remains were laid to rest with the people's respects below. Uh, with the re people's respect below these very statues. monkey wearing a beanie um i think the dog is wearing like a like a i don't know a scarf or like an i don't know neck warmer thing and the bird is wearing like a cape that's cool okay so, I guess we'll head back to town. Right on now. Uh oh. Use them. Save as well. Across the bridge now. Up this hill. Hirokami Hall is just up this hill. Well, I guess it's more of a mountain, but whatever you call it, it's uh, uphill from here. All uphill from here. Alrighty. Great then is that Yakami Hall Ether What then do we have here? Level three or level three a three star very area dolls. Professor Jacques? What the? 
Why is he here? Um, excuse me? Oh, hello, hello, Bliss. Enjoying that school trip, are you? Why are you... <laughs> I came to check on how you're doing. I am your homeroom teacher, after all. Well, who's... who's... What? <laughs> who's... who's your substitute? Once I got here, I decided to do a bit of research on the Pokémon of Kirukami and... Oh, that's right. Sorry. I got so engrossed in my own research that I actually forgot to come find you, didn't I? Well, how about I make up for it by treating you to a picnic? I thought something like this might happen, so I borrowed all the usual picnic things from Director Cavill. Cavill, sorry. He's a... a gulpin. Again, I hope you like the sandwiches I made. Wait, where's... Where's Maridon? <laughs> it may, um, look a bit strange, but I can assure you it tastes great. I don't get out much, so this kind of field work sure wears me out quick. Can't believe you... Uh, how you kids run all over the place for your treasure hunt. You're really something. Oh? Could there be something in my basket? Oh, is there some? What is it? An egg! Feast your eyes on that! A Pokemon egg appeared in the basket! Quite the mystery, isn't it? I only brought Gulpin to this picnic with me, and yet... How could it have been... Yeah, how could it... How could it have appeared then? Did you put the egg in the basket? <laughs> I can't get anything past you, can I, Bliss? You know... You know about the Pokemon eggs you can find during picnics, right? Whenever a trainer doesn't have the means to care for an egg they find, they can have it sent to the academy where we'll take care of it. So then I thought, say, wouldn't it be better to have a great trainer raise the Pokemon instead? So I brought this egg with me. And now, it's yours, Bliss. Oh boy. You were entrusted with a Pokemon egg. <laughs> I know it's odd of me to come all this way to Kitakami just to hand over a Pokemon egg. But I knew it would be safe with you, Bliss. That reminds me, are you still using your Pokedex app over here too? You should be able to fill the Kirikami Pokedex by catching Pokemon that live around here. I'll be doing field work in the area for a while. So let me know if you manage to complete the Kirikami Pokedex in your app. So you'll be here the whole time? Cool, swine up. Kinda odd to see a swine up here, huh? Oh, an apon. Okay, I actually want to hatch that egg. So... Hatch this egg real quick. I already have a Pokemon with flame bodies, so... You're new. Hmm. 
Okay. Let's hatch. Let, let's hatch this guy. Just gonna ride around the community center here. I really do wonder what this egg is. I'm really curious. Oh. Alright, let's see what it is. Twig. Huh. It's cool. Put it in this box here. Oh! Gave us a starter. Very neat. Nope, not that. Here. Second. Picks for her? I think Rock Ruff Ruff's already in. Let's go of it. Are you new? Uh oh. No, you're not new. I thought that was an Oshawott for some reason. Okay, what else is here? Is cricket tot? Cricket tot new? I don't remember. If I have a can Kento Kento Vulpix, I don't know if I I do not. I don't have a Vulpix in general. because of the lag. There's a Rolts. Head. Oh, 
Oh, hey, C dot. Is it C dot now? C dot is new. Beans. Oh, a new face. It's not. It's why no. Must felt. What? All the wag new? No, I don't think Polywag's new. Is Polywag new? Polywag is new. Magic Harp here. Slam. Zinc. Ooh, Ducklet. A whole family of Ducklet. Is Ducklet new? Is new. We catch noise. to run into the Starly. Oh, I don't think Chudo's new. There's a weird angle. And the the quick balls reverse. Well not reverse, but you know facing the wrong way. Catching a lot of new Pokemon, which is awesome. And now I'm curious, I don't even remember if Trudel's new or not. Trudel isn't new. Ooh, a Quagsire!
got a quack. So now we don't have to overload the Looper we caught. <laughs> Where's Lotad? For catch. Hey, low tag. Box level two. City kids. I think this is a good place to stop for the night. It is almost five o'clock. But I did also start a bit early than my used to starting time. But yeah. I think this is a good place to stop, and um, yeah, I'm enjoying the DLC so far. I know we're just we're still in the beginning parts of the DLC, but um, it's getting uh, pretty interesting. We're starting to get into the, the lore of um, I forgot what the ogre, the mask, ogre Pokemon is called, but we get into the lore of the ogre and the um, the loyal three. So that's awesome. Get into the good stuff. But um yeah. Um I don't know when I'll you know stream again and continue this. There's a lot there's other games I need to still continue as well. Um Don't need to finish um the DLC in uh, East Odyssey. Uh, some other games, I'm sure I need to finish. 
There's a lot of games I haven't finished yet on stream. And I'm just adding on to it. And I'm already, like, not streaming as much as, I'm, as I used to already. So, yeah. And I also saw that Tales of Arise... Um, is getting a DLC, which if you guys didn't know, don't remember, I did a playthrough, I streamed the main story, you know, uh, did stream Tales of Arise on the channel, it was a great game, I didn't, I enjoyed it, um, but yeah, they announced the DLC, I think, um, on the, uh, or during the, um, the state of place uh live stream i think something like that so yeah i'll be i need to check out that that trailer and see what it um what it's about but yeah i hope you guys are enjoying the uh the teal mask dlc so far um again i don't know when i'm gonna stream again probably on my next off day um which is probably sometime next week because they only gave me one off day this week. I don't know why. Uh, but yeah, today is my only off day this week. And um, we'll see how next week looks. And uh, yeah, definitely let you guys know then. But I appreciate you guys coming by, hanging out, and watching. Hope you guys, again, are enjoying the, f um, the first stream of the Teal Mask. And uh, yeah. Hope you guys have a great rest of your night or day, depending on what time it is for you. And I'll see you guys uh, whenever I stream again. Again, I guess I'll be mostly sometime next week. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.